sale catfish caught right here in South Florida and uh, that we're cooking today a nice catfish curry so I just cleaning now I'm gonna cut up and I'm just rinsing now Gosh, these guys are so fresh nice size as well The tail and the head is my favorite part. A little bit of green seasoning and some garlic into this to season before we cook. Just mix that. Hi everybody. Today my sister is uh, wanting some fish curry Guyana style or Sandy style here. We'll use the things we have. And these are some catfish that we actually caught here as well. I seasoned and it's ready to cook. And I'm also putting in some eggs because um, little Joshua, my nephew, do not eat the fish, but he will eat the eggs. So we're putting in some boiled eggs, some chicken eggs as well. What I have here, these are some eggs and I have some oil in here. And I like to fry the eggs first. Guys, all I need is a little bit of color on the eggs. Because these are all our garden freshness that I went around the garden. I'll attach this video to that. Um, check this out. We have some bilimbi, a soury moringa or the saijan, also known as the drumsticks. These are so good. I love them with everything. It's one of my favorite dish also in India uh, was this. I think it's called Samba or Samo or something like that. But I need to look it up. And we also picked some Karaila or the Karaili, also known as the bitter melon. And of course, we have some fresh root peppers and habanero from the garden as well. Oh, and check out my tomatoes as well from the garden right up here. Let's take these out there. And Let's start cooking our fish. We, I like to saute my onions first. Putting the onions in there and also some tomatoes. And let's go over here and get some curry leaves from right over here. This is also where we picked all our riru peppers and also uh, our pick our peppers. Take these. John missed these. Look at this and uh, check out all these riru peppers. We already picked all the ripe ones. How loaded these guys are. So I'll put some curry leaves in there. Mm. And what we have here now, this is our masala curry powder and also jeera 
Uh, these are our, and this is mixed masala and some salt in there. This is our curry mixture for our catfish curry. Put a little bit of water here to make it into a paste. Put this in there. Ooh, man, oh my gosh, the aroma in this in this uh, backyard is fantastic. It smells so yummy. Making all the neighbor hungry here for catfish curry. Get that going. Okay, you want to get all the paste, curry paste in there. Hey Johnny. Guys, uh, so this is garlic and uh, some riri peppers and my green seasoning and chives. And for green seasoning, I'm using a little bit of uh, celery thyme, fine leaf thyme, and also some culantro, also known as the shadow benny or the bandania. So put this in here now. Cutting up one of my yellow habanero. My sister love hot food. So I'm cooking this a little spicy. Put that in there as well. Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments, guys, if you like to put the Karaila Karaili okra. I don't have any mangoes right now, and, and and I love the bilimbi. The bilimbi is working like mangoes, but if you have like tamarind and things like that, it's so good in fish curry. Man, check out this fish here. Nice big, nice catfish, guys. Nice catfish. Thank you, Captain Omar and Johnny, our friends who took us out. And these were fresh caught. John and I actually caught these fish. Okay, ready? I'll put in, guys, look, in the, look at a saijan in there and the karaila. Now put in the fish. Get all the green seasoning. Oh, it's so nice to cook out there. It's so nice. For the last several days, we've been having a lot of rain and it's been cold, believe it or not. So the perfect sunshine is coming out here in South Florida. There you are. Alright, let's stir this up and let it bunge and then we'll add a little bit hot water in it for gravy. The salt and everything is all ready with the masala. All right, guys, let this bonje cover it, and then we'll add a little bit of water, like I said. I want to see this. Guys, meet Joshua. Say hello, Joshua. This is another channel. 
and um, everybody know Joshua he's, he's been here three times now three times so he's here visiting with his mom big and hugs. look how strong he's getting he gets so big look how tall he's getting for me already look look how tall he is you know next time he come he'll be passing me pass go me so do you like catfish no but you like to go catch it right on the yeah. fishing pole what do you like here he likes the eggs so this is for Joshua we're making the eggs one side for Joshua say bye everybody <laughs> oh, this lid. Alright, guys, check this out. Check this out. What I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna cover it. Oh, look how good that's looking. Just cover it to bunje. And I'll go heat up some water to pour a little bit in there for a little bit of gravy with rice or roti. We have some water. You don't want to torn it because it might break. So I'm going to put some hot water in there. And you just shake it, guys. You shake it. Gently, gently. Guys, I shook off my wing guard. It's very windy right now. See? Side channel, all kinds of good stuff is in here. Is this? Okay, go ahead. A little yummy. Okay. Guys, so what are we going to do now? Everything is coming to a boil. And uh, we'll close it up. And then in a little bit, we'll put our bilimbi. In a little bit, we'll put our bilimbi, our eggs, and extra peppers. Is, is hey, everybody. hey, everybody. We are, I'm making some hot dogs and some fresh french fries in my air fryer for Joshua. You like french fries? You yeah, chips? I like yeah, yeah, sure. What do you call them, chips? So 390 for 20 minutes, it will start it now. And this is what they look like now. First, they cut slices and a little bit of oil. They'll cook and turn into french fries, bud, but I'll be. Guys, um, I already picked some tomato for the curry. I'm going to pick some now for salad. Tomato and um, cucumber like a chow. Nice fresh tomato. Oh my gosh, look at this. Okay, check out that curry is cooking up nice. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna put in our eggs. And also our bilimbi. And, uh, and some pepper fell in there. And my sister loves this is almost finished it has about three or so minutes more and that's why I'm putting in the bilimbi gonna steam in there that's all you need and I put in the eggs as well so now we're gonna put in the peppers okay. big pot of curry catfish saijan Karaili, soury, eggs, land and sea together, my friends, land and sea. <laughs> so good, I can't wait to dig in with my fingers. Let's make some salad or chow to go on the side. Alright, we're making a little cucumber chow. Peeling the cucumber. I'm just gonna peel some of the skin off. I'll leave some of it on. And just chip it in there. Ooh, this will be so good with the fish 
with our fish and um, also rice. We're eating this with rice and roti. Let's finish up this curry, guys. Let's finish up the curry. Wait. Curry is finished, so I'm gonna put some of this fresh tomato I just picked, just a couple pieces there. And guys, and also a little bit of shives or scallions. And I have some peppers and so on in there as well. So our curry is finished. Ooh, I'm so excited to eat that. Let's cut up, these are some shadow benny for our cucumber chow. And we have pepper and garlic. I love this. I learned this in Trinidad. And thank you all to all my Trinidad friends for teaching me how to do the chow. And I'm also going to put some of this hot pepper in here. Let's put one of the marirri as well. Mix up the pepper. Can you see? Okay, put that. And then a little bit of garlic. I will put a little bit of chives as well as in here and now a little bit of salt and pepper and uh, a little bit of vinegar or a squeeze of lime I picked another tomato from the garden we'll put that in here as well and the sourness in the tomato as well gonna act as like a lime or a lemon Put a little bit of black pepper in here now. Black pepper and now a little bit of salt. And let's mix this up. Hey Joshua, what's up, bud? You're bored, huh? <laughs> Try to get it all the way around. Oh, curry is finished, guys. Did I? The last of our curry. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. Our lunch is finished. Thank you so much for being part of us. Thank you for subscribing and also for leaving comments. And uh, I'm excited to have this, guys. I'm excited to have this. What you got? What you got? Oh my god! Where'd you go? To, you hey, went to. What, Uncle? Where'd you go to the store to get that? Yeah. Uncle no, you did. Uncle John made him some uh, hot dogs with some homemade French fries and ketchup. And the fries is in the air fryer. Air fryer. Instead That's of awesome. frying, frying. Did you air fry the hot dog too? Yes, I did. I heat it up and get those scores, the blisters. Awesome! Great lunch. Mmm. I steal. John's air frying lunch. This is a good hot dog. 
and I'm waiting for my sister so we can eat together.